Yeshua from, from uh, Jerusalem. And, uh, I was just enjoying looking back on the February of 1986 film, the video, not time, <coughs> of Anatoly Sharansky arriving in Israel uh, to freedom. And the most significant uh, grammar that emerges from the your words, I'm not going to forget those who were left behind in exile, in prison, in the struggle for the freedom and the rights. Good for you. I haven't seen you in a while. How are you? And your family. Uh, let's see, where are we now? I guess the good news is, uh, even though you don't, yourself understand it. Uh, you do understand it because the, the God of the cosmos imposed it upon you in your life. Exile has ended. But it didn't end when you uh, came out of the gulag in Russia and arrived in Israel after the tremendous struggle. Uh, the collapse of the local reality uh, around the globe began in a few years later, uh, in uh, February 26th, uh, 1991, and then in December 25th, 1991, uh, it collapsed, uh, the former Soviet Union collapsed, and 15 uh, nations emerged uh, from the former Soviet Union. And that's the beginning of the collapse of the local reality, the end of exile. Now, the uh, continued 1992, the collapse of the local reality came to this Slav Republic and other seven nations uh, emerged and, uh, with, the, with the murder of Rabin uh, we experienced the collapse of the local reality in Israel all denials and disclaimers notwithstanding Zionism in Israel was a secular articulation uh, <coughs> Israel's uh, Israel's future existence determines upon the ending the denial of the collapse of the local reality and inhabiting the quantum reality, which is redemption, uh, as, a, as a religious nation of moderate, uh, secular and religious. Uh, the secular construct is uh, insightful in the region, domestically and otherwise, and it's not worked. It's failed miserably, and uh, the God of the cosmos and God of Israel are one in an intolerance. Uh, that's why it's collapsed. You said, I repeat, I'm not going to forget those left behind in exile. Okay, they're not in exile anymore. But uh, the bad news is we're all still in simulating exile as we cling to the collapse of the local reality, we cling to ground zero. The collapse of Zionism was the end of uh, exile on a psychosocial level in Israel. Its Zionism collapsed on November 5th, 1995. And, uh, I can only speak for myself. My friend was murdered. And uh, as I look at the film and remember uh, the shared uh, uh, leadership of Israel, there was at the time uh, a rotating uh, musical chairs between Perez and uh, Shamir. This was not one of our brightest moments very much illuminated and brightened up when, uh, when you arrived, thanks to your blessed wife. Now having said that, let's, uh, let's, let's come to uh, what has to be said in this video. Um, I appreciate and respect your leaving the Knesset, uh, but you've not yet come to the center and uh, ended the denial. Uh, the collapse of the local realities ended, ended exile on all four levels your life personally, and your family, your community, and your nation, and around the world. The framework that um, <coughs> replaces giving to receive was the model of exile. What replaces that is receiving to, receiving to give, which is in Hebrew, kabel bishfilotet. The framework in which we attain uh, developmentally culturally uh, implement uh, the post-collapse is humanomics in general, which is comprised
surprise that the paradigm to see begin and the economic paradigm of integration of labor. Uh, this is what the <coughs> this is what you have to inhabit, this is the learning curve you have to ascend. And I'm certain you will. Um, I want to say that um, it's important to recall that in leaving the Knesset made the correct choice, as did of a few others, um, but it doesn't matter that it's for the wrong reasons. Your intuition was correct in, in, the, in the gulag in Russia, and your intuition is collect in the, uh, correct in the political gulag in Israel. You left it. And uh, I'm, uh, I'm well experienced after 22 years of uh, house arrest, uh, not participating in Israel's political gulag. We well understand what it is that's wrong in Israel. Uh, and for the, uh, the diaspora, it's, uh, it's, still, uh, it's still a learning curve for them. Having settled this, um, uh, let us uh, uh, comment lastly on uh, the threat to Jerusalem. The threat to Jerusalem is the threat to Israel itself. And uh, your terms of reference are political and geopolitical. Uh, inhabiting the quantum reality and transforming um, the uh, the model of Israel from uh, giving to receive to receiving to give will end the uh, the very threat that you uh, most fear. And uh, so let us begin with that. And uh, the Jerusalem campaign is focused on that very issue, and I'll talk to that more uh, in other videos. Uh, I wish you. Speed and blessings to you and your wife and your family. And uh, uh, we'll talk to you again soon. Well, I was noticing in the time of ch uh, uh, you came to Israel, Anatoly Sharansky, and now you're not on Sharansky. I think uh, I think I like the. Uh,